What is up everyone and welcome to my Mountain Daughter quest guide. The only requirements you need to complete this quest are having level 20 agility and you do have to defeat a level 70 monster that can be safe spotted. I will show you how to safe spot it so just bring food and gear depending on what level you are. For items you're going to need one rope, a pickaxe of any kind, an axe of any kind, and a regular plank, as well as some gloves of any kind, except slayer gloves or bracelets. I also recommend bringing a fall door or tablet teleport to make things faster, as well as a teleport back, be it a Camelot teleport or a house teleport to the Fermanic house portal. To start this quest, come right here, just west or east of Rilekka and northeast of Camelot. Follow the path next to the guard with, in front of the rocks, then use the rope on the boulder. Head east, follow the path until you reach the chieftain's tent. Enter the chieftain's tent will be the one with the two tables and talk to the chieftain. Why is everyone so hostile? So what are you doing up here? Yes. Now head up and grab a pole. Grab a pole. Once you have a pole, head south and dig some mud on this area right here. Just south of the tent. And now head north. Follow the path around the pool and then use the mud on the tree. Then climb the tree. Use the pole on the rocks. And then use the plank on the flat stone. And then listen to the shining pool. Hello, who are you? So what exactly do you want from me? That sounds like something I can do. I'll get right on it. Now use the plank on the flat rock. And yes. Head back to the chieftain. And talk to him. Talk about your people Rilekka. Talk to him again. Talk about the food supply. Never mind. And I head north and talk to Joku. Now you want to find Sveen, who is wandering around this area. I'll show you guys what he looks like. At this point in the quest, you can just climb over this. You don't have to use the rope anymore. Go ahead and climb down the climb over the rocks. And there's VD. VD. That's Beam, sorry. Fox is VD. Can I persuade you somehow? Now head west and talk to the chieftain of Verleka. Enter the long hall and talk to Burdened. Talk about the mountain camp. Did it contain vast magic? And I'll head back the, to the mountain camp. Now enter the tent with the rock and use the pickaxe on the rock. Now return to the chieftain.
talk to the chieftain about where the mountain camp. Now you want to relocate Svidi and give him the safety guarantee. Again, he is roaming around this area. Talk to Svidi. Or just moonwalk. And now we're heading over to the top of Ice Mountain. You can either run there, all the way down over to Sears Village, across from Catherby, and all the way on top of the mountain. Or you can just use a Camelot teleport. Once you reach the top of the mountain, next to the glider, there's two bushes. Pick from either one. Make sure you have your gloves equipped. And then eat the pear. Now return to the mountain camp. Once you're back at the camp, talk to the chieftain. How about your food supplies? How about the people of Veleka? And now head back across the lake. Before you head across the lake, pick up five rocks, five mu muddy stones, Now head back across the lake. Climb the tall tree. Use the pole on the rocks. And use the plank on the flat rocks or the flat stones. The big ass plank. And I'll listen to the shining pool again. Now use the plank on the flat stone again, to head back, now go around the pool all the way to the other side. Now you can get ready to fight the boss which is right across this area. Chop down the trees around the way. And enter the cave. Head through the cave, and you find the pile of corpses. Try to take the corpse of the woman. I'm just no. I'm just me. No one special. You mean a sacrifice? You look like a man in a bear suit. Can I see that corpse? I humbly request to give the remains. And I will kill you myself. Now, head back to this area and you can stay spot the bear. Just like that. After you kill the furry, pick up the corpse, and head out of the cave. Chop the trees on your way, and head back to the chieftain. Talk to the chieftain, but he's not a god. I will. Now head back up to the pond and make sure you have one free inventory space. Talk to Ragnar. Thank you. 
and not head right back across. Head to the very east of the little island and bury the corpse. Now use the muddy stones on the mound. And that is a Mountain Daughter quest complete. I hope this guide helps you guys. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Wait! Before you click off the video, I want to thank all the Motley crew members for the support and helping me make more videos. As well as I want to let you know that in the description down below, there will be a link to the Discord where you can join our community, get notified on the latest.